Well, here is your before and after. Uh, Ingrid, Ingrid Borg is a model here at HSN, and you've seen her on air many times, and apparently she has uh, multiple hairstyles constantly <laughs> <laughs> with her secret weapon, uh, a Gabor wig. And you know, if you've worked in television like all of us has, we know that all of us ladies have a secret weapon to have our hair look perfect all the time. This is an amazing today's special. It is one day, one day only. We've got three different styles. I am wearing laughter. I'll be changing out during the show. Laughter is the shortest style. I'll give you like a little kind of tour. You, uh, right now in the laughter, you have all colors. But remember, you can sort of zhuzh this. You know, honestly, it's with your fingers that you style it. You just sort of like do a little here, a little there, and then you are good to go. It just takes like two seconds. So this is the shortest version. The version that I'm wearing, it is called laughter. Over here is called polish. Polish is super fun, super sassy. It is also, uh, you know, a shorter style, but it is uh, a little bit longer than laughter. Then the longest one we have is called visionary. And visionary is the longest of the three styles. 70% of the quantity that we have for today is already sold out. So I am told that we will sell this out during my show. Apparently a lot of the hosts have been wearing this. I know Bobby wore it, Shannon Fox might have worn it. So well, you've been seeing this and I'll, I'm gonna put this on as well. I think we've sold out of a couple colors right now, but the dark blonde is gone, but we do have the other colors. So um, we're gonna show you a little color chart here, but I'm gonna walk over to Martino, who has all the colors in front of him. Martino Cartier is our special guest. Perhaps you recognize him from Tabitha's Makeover. He is a runway artist for hair shows. He is also the head of the Wigs and Wishes charity that gives wigs to people who need it who are going through maybe cancer treatments or That's for right. whatever reason, which is amazing. I actually had the honor of being involved in uh, one of the amazing things with Paula Abdul was there, yeah. superstars, everything. <laughs> I was just like, I had a great time and it was like so moving. Thanks for being a part of it. And, and you know how you change someone just by changing their hair? This is really for everybody. This is for everybody because wigs are not just for people that lose their hair to medical conditions. Wigs are an accessory to your fashion statement. Almost Every celebrity client I have at one point or another wears a wig. So I'm telling you today, you're gonna to see all different styles, all different colors, and you should grab more than one. You can be red one day, you can be blonde one day without any commitment. So here's the colors. Okay. The light blonde is just that. It's our lightest blonde. It has seven to 11 different shades of blonde within that wig. Look at that, oh, that's a great shot. Look at all those gorgeous highlights and lowlights. The medium blonde still has a lot of highlights, but not as many as the light. So we're going to take it down like about two levels. The dark blonde I'm going to skip because we're sold out of that in the oh, long Oh, and one. medium blonde is last call for visionary, which is okay. the longest style. Gotcha. So the me the dark blonde, which we do have in the other styles, uh, is a much softer blonde. We it's have it in cooler. only in laughter, which only is what I'm wearing. Only in laughter with what you're wearing. Yeah. Got it. So 7 to 11. Your medium red is really beautiful with the rich caramels that are in there. And you have a lot of shades of red, again, 7 to 11. When we move down to the light brown, the light brown is a beautiful soft color. But look how natural that looks. It doesn't look shiny and plastic. It looks shiny and healthy like real hair. And then when we go to the medium brown, that's a little bit richer. That's when it's, you're gonna see some red tones in it, some gold tones. And then the dark brown can be for anybody that has dark brown hair, black hair. You don't have to get caught up in the colors. They will right. work for a bunch of shades up or down, you know, according to right. what you have. Is that is that what Ingerborg is wearing? Yes, she is. Okay, okay. Yes. there you and go. And then last Gorgeous. is the light gray. The light gray is perfect. You cannot get this out of a bottle. This is either something God gives you or Gabor <laughs> gives you. Yes. You can't get it in the salon. So I'm going to go ahead over to well, the Well, it is like the in color. And my 19-year-old daughter had her hair dyed this color. And Steven Anderson, who's helping backstage with the, the wigs and he owns a salon mm -hmm. he says everybody's coming in and they wants are. this color absolutely that silver platinum it's like the cool instagram color it is and what i love about this wig that she's wearing is that it's super light i'm going to show you how my fingers go through the wig that just shows you they're not hot because i've been getting oh, yeah. emails all day yes. is it hot yeah. will i sweat is it hard to adjust let me show you that e answer that email i'm stuck uh <laughs> hard to adjust not at all there's these tabs right here you just peel and and stick to make it bigger and you do the opposite to make it 
tighter. When you get it home, you're gonna take it out of the box. You're gonna give it a shake. It's a heat-friendly synthetic fiber, which means there's no cuticle. So it can't get frizzy. When it gets wet, it's gonna go right back to the way it was out of the box. Watch how easy it is for her to switch out her wig without me touching it. It comes with this cap. And then I just shake it a little bit, or a lot. <laughs> and then the tabs are in the back. And then I just pull that on. And then I have two tabs at the side, so I centered that. And then I just finger style it with my hand, actually. And if you notice, the part was on the other side before, so now I switched it up a little bit and I part it on the opposite side. Yeah, you can the change the side. part, you can cut the bang shorter, you can cut the back shorter, you can just treat it like it's your own hair. And once you get it on, if you put your fingers on these little tabs that are right here, and you look in the mirror, if your fingers are even, then you know the wig's straight. See how my right, fi my right finger is a okay. little bit higher? Is this the medium so, red she's wearing? This is the medium red. Okay. Now they're even. Well, they were even. Okay. Now, All right, there you go. They're even. There we go. So <laughs> that's how you can make sure it's even. And again, like she said, you're just going to run your fingers through it. And you can put your favorite hairspray in it. So if you want to, like, sass it up a little bit, you can sass it up. If you want to, mm -hmm. you know, give her that little faux hawk right there. <laughs> with her little bang. You can definitely switch this up and make it fun. Yeah, and you just really basically just use your fingers. There's yep, nothing else. That's it. Yeah, you look good. So there's oh. no heating tools, <laughs> shampoo, conditioner, you can use blow dry, tools. heating tool, but it's not a 40 minute right. you know, process, but it's you a can, two seconds. You can put heat on these wigs up to 350 degrees. That's her before shot. Her hair normally takes her two hours to do mm -hmm. at best and still doesn't look good when she's done according to her. This is polish. In this the red. polish, correct. In medium red. Polish in medium red. I th it looks so amazing. You know, putting a wig on really changes you. Um, yes. On my Facebook page, I had ch put on a whole bunch of different Gabor wigs and put them on, and I got so many comments. Uh, yes, it is, Chris, the director, all me. Every single <laughs> picture <laughs> is me, and it's me, like, with different kind of different cuts, different, you know, color, different everything. And even if you're saying, you know what, maybe I want to go back to my natural color, or maybe I'm going to go all silver, start with wearing a wig around in real life and then see if you like it. Yes. Plus, it, for those that are trying to grow out their color because they want that gray to come in, it's a lot of work to grow out hair yes. color. You cannot color yes, your old true. color to make it gray, yes. not the gray that you're getting from your scalp. So if you wear a gray wig in the process, it makes it a lot easier. But that looks great on you. Mm -hmm. I love that. that it's looks lightweight. Great. That's why I love it. You know, I wear them all year round. You were telling me. Yeah, you know, it's Florida and it's hot. Do you ever feel hot when you're wearing <laughs> Never, them? Never, because they're breathable. I mean, the old wigs I used to wear, yes, but not like these. These are just breathable. They're lightweight, and I just love it. It's I, comfortable. You know, that's a really good point because mm -hmm. wigs, are, obviously, the technology has changed, just yes. like cell phones aren't the same. Everything the technology has changed. Well, last night changed. when we launched the TS, the producer in my ear, Steve, was saying to me, he goes, you've got 10 seconds. Get her wig on. On. And I said, it is on. He didn't even know that the host had her wig on, which right, I thought right, was right. pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, it just, it really, it really looks really natural as I you walk around. What about taking care of them? How often do you wash them? How do you so wash them? What's the deal? It depends on how often you wear it, but let's say you wear it every day and you want to wash it once a month. You'll just fill up your kitchen sink with a little water, put some of my Martino shampoo in it, swish it around, change the water to rinse it, let it air dry. You can blow dry, but you don't have to. If you air dry, it'll go right back to this. If you air dry it, it goes right back to the right style. Right because there's it no does. cuticle. No cuticle on it. That's pretty amazing. I can't tell you how many hours I struggle with styling my hair oh. to have the, all that time yes. back. It's so <laughs> freeing. Yes. You know? And the, the volume you have in your crown on all three ladies, that there is a micro back combing at the scalp of this wig. Oh. That never can come out. Even if you brush it, you comb, it's permanent down inside. And that will always keep you to have that gorgeous volume and never get that split that everybody can't stand in the back of their head. This is... That's wildness. Uh, that's wild. And revolutionary. Right. And you know what? This is something you've always been doing, right, Inger? Because you, yes. it's not like you just started doing it this no. week for the show. No, I've been <laughs> doing this for years now. I've yeah. worked here a long time, and I wear wigs all the time. Yeah. And Gabor is the best wigs. They're lightweight. I got caught in the rain. Mm -hmm. Nothing happened to my hair. I looked the same uh, way right. before I started raining. Getting, ca getting caught in the rain, <laughs> that is the... Because, you know, when it rains mm -hmm. out, you're like, okay, I can't go outside if you just have done your hair. Yeah, and with these, again, they get wet. When they dry, they go right back to the way they looked before. 
So, I mean, that's just worth everything. And, you know, Gabor has been around for 50 years. And, you know, over the last 10 years, I've donated over 250,000 wigs to women going through chemotherapy for free. And 90, 95% of those wigs have come from Hair You Wear. And that's how this partnership began with myself and Hair You Wear and Gabor and here at HSN. So it's a pretty so, great, it's an amazing company. And this is the one I'm wearing. Yes. So this is laughter and in the in this gray silver. And we've got a before and after, but if you go into a salon and say, I want that cool gray silver color that everybody's wearing, it, it really damages your hair to do that, it's right? It's a lot of work and you're <laughs> never gonna get this. This has a slight teeny bit of subtle pepper in it. And you cannot do that in a salon. Yeah. You literally have to pick up one hair in color. Right. One day, it's not happening. <laughs> right, right. I mean, it's so fun and it's so freeing yeah. to say, I'm just gonna run out the door and my hair's gonna look amazing. Yeah, that's I the mean, truth. it's, you got Guys, if you've never tried a wig, today is the day because we have a today special. By the way, we're here live. I would love for you guys to call in. Maybe you have a question for Martino. Here's our toll-free testimonial line. It's 1-866-376-8255. Maybe you just bought the first wig you've ever bought and you have like a question. It's probably the same question that everybody else has. So call in and ask your question. Say, say why you're wearing it. I had a neighbor when I lived in California and she had thinning hair and she had a wig that she put on and the confidence she felt when she had her wig on she just felt fantastic Absolutely. you know and I think women as we get older we our hair gets thin just like men does it men, does men's well, hair as, gets you know our hair is made up of keratin same. and as we get older I was actually on The View I did a whole special on keratin in, in the hair and as you get older you lose that keratin and as you lose it the hair gets smaller it's called minimization the hair shrinks it gets more brittle and there's nothing we can really do about it except put on a wig yeah, and you know, when you turn on the TV and see like your favorite actress, you know, 20 years in and you're like, wow, her hair still looks amazing. Guess what? Hashtag wig. Yeah, for real. And <laughs> so, somebody had Facebooked, uh, sent me an email uh, after the last show saying, I have long hair. Am I able to put it under the short wig without it being bulky? This is why I have her turned this way. Yeah. You can see how long her hair is. You basically just want to take your own hair, split it down the middle into two ponytails, and crisscross them, bring them up, stick a bobby pin, and that will keep it flat. Right, and and by the way, you guys know that I have long hair. Just did the same, same thing, thing, split it in half, twisted it, put it here. You put the cap on, and the cap comes with it, and then you put the wig on. Now we've got, three different styles here they are right here visionary is the longest that is probably going to sell out during this presentation we have also have polish which is the medium length i'm wearing laughter which is the shortest length so we have you know we're starting to lose some colors but we have lots of colors to choose from as a matter of fact we can go over to the colors and show them to you live but i will tell you this is so fun so <laughs> freeing people are like freaked out walking around like, oh, is that you hell like is that you people it's really fun it's really fun fun to kind of mix it up you know you can even wear something that looks similar to what you have or you can go a completely different way absolutely. it's really up to you absolutely you need to have fun with it think about everything you've ever thought about wigs throw out because this is not my grandmom's wig this is new technology that makes it look like it's real hair you're not it doesn't look plastic it doesn't look like a doll head and you're getting seven to eleven different yeah. shades within each wig that's to give you that depth and to yeah. make it look so natural we've got the light blonde You've got right. the medium blonde. The dark blonde is a really pretty color. It's a nice, cool, uh, like, uh, light brown, dark yeah. blonde. The medium red is rich with caramel highlights. You've got some cinnamon tones in it. And then when you go to the light brown, the light brown is a beautiful, just neutral brown. When you jump to medium, it's a little bit warmer. You're going to see some red tones, some gold tones. Mm -hmm. And when you go to dark brown, dark brown will work if you have black hair, dark brown hair, it, even a dark medium hair. They all have that 7 to 11 shades, which gives you freedom to go up or down when you're picking out a wig for yourself. And of course, the light gray, same thing, really beautiful color. Yeah, and um, on Facebook, people are asking that question that we were just talking about, about the long hair going under a wig. Um, I did it. Um, our last model did it. It's, it's really all you do is part it, twist it. The cap comes with it. I'm going to show you the three styles. This is laughter. Laughter is the one I'm wearing right now. I'm going to change into the visionary, then I'll change into okay. the polish. But right now, you're seeing this is laughter. This is the shortest one. And it is also something that you can finger style, just with your fingers, go it like this. Or you could also put in a, like a little hairspray, and you can have it be kind of like a little more, like a little more kind of fun and trendy. It, 
it's up to you, but you never have to style it. Uh, you don't have to do anything awesome. to it. They're so, so amazing. Wigs are just, they're game changers. Then this is called Polish. Polish is the medium one. It's the one where it's got a little more length to be kind of a little sassy. And you can kind of go like this in the back and really make it kind of fluff up. And it's really, really cool. I, I, this is actually what, one of my favorites. You're gonna see, you're gonna see me in this one. This, this looks really, really cool. I really like this. But if you're somebody that has longer hair or you're trying to grow your hair out and you want to have this this style this is the longest this is visionary visionary you can actually tuck it behind your ears you can put even little hair clips you can do a twist to it and you can also ha have it look like you've got like a little updo and uh, I know Martino has is you know been talking about that all day so color wise in the visionary Last call on the gray, there's only 90 left. I, and in medium blonde, there's only 40 left. So getting very, very limited. I think I'm gonna take uh, the visionary, as a matter of fact, since we're going uh, out. Is it this one is visionary right here? Let me see. The dark one that I had on before. Yes, yes. Okay. You wanna do so, it? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it in front of the TV set so everybody can see me do it live. So let me see if, if I, where should I stand? Can I get a... Oh, right here. Okay, can I do it right here? So I'm gonna take this off, and it's got like, I've got like a little cap, so I just put my hand down there, and you can see my hair's tucked up in there. And then you just give the wig a little shake. I got a little, little tutorial. You've got, um, the tag goes in the back, just like you're putting your top on. And then in the front, you just hold it in the front and the back, kind of like you're putting on like a shower cap. And you push it here, and then you go like this, and it just takes a second to finger style. So, let me see, upside down and backwards on TV. Okay, I gotta remember that. <laughs> upside down and backwards. And then there's little tabs, so I wanna make sure that the tabs are even. Let me see, okay. They are even like that. Yeah, you there. did good. There, that's pretty good. Um, although you, you at home are probably not wearing uh, earpiece. That's the only thing that, <laughs> that's probably the only thing that came out. How, how'd I do? It looks good. I'm just gonna <laughs> hit it with this comb real quick for yeah. you. Yeah, I mean, you probably do this in front of a mirror. Yeah, you're not gonna do <laughs> so, it blindfolded. Not so. gonna do it blindfolded like I'm, like I'm doing it. But, but you can see a different color. Now this color, as I look down memory lane, might be closer to my natural color from uh, a million years ago because I've been go blonde for a long, long time. But you did good. Yeah, I, I, I love it. You know, it's got like a richness to it and just cute. And okay, so this is the middle, this is the polish. And I think I'm wearing medium brown. You are. Medium brown. And you can tuck it behind yes. your ear. And if you turn to the side, you, can, you don't see the construction of the wig, even with it tucked behind your ear. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, and this is visionary. Correct. So this is the one that is most limited and you do have it available in the color that I'm wearing. You know, you can even do like little barrettes here. I could even do it like an updo. I could do like a little pin, like a little twist like here. And then it would look like a little updo. This one is really very versatile. I, you know, so lots of fun, lots of versatility. This is Polish, the one you were talking hey. about a minute ago. Right? Okay. So yes. Take a look at the back of this. This has so much fun and so much like, it's like, it's like hair that flirts, right? It's got all this texture and the waves. You Yet the front really frames the face. She's got a beautiful fringe, nice volume on the top. Um, and again, when you look at her before shot, it's night and day, night and day. Oh, cute. This is so dressy, so formal. And, but yeah, you can also tone it down too. We have it all fluffed up to get it, you know, as big as possible just by running <laughs> your fingers through it. And you know, you think about it, you go to the, if you wanted to go to a salon and get that styled, that's gonna be a lot of money. You probably spend more than the price of the wig just to get your hair styled. Wash, comb, dry, curled, yeah, blow dry. At sure. today's special price. So it's only $89. By the way, here's something that you may not expect. If you don't like the wig, you can return it. Some wig stores, you buy a wig, you can't return it. I don't think any of them let you return it. Yeah, I was going to say, we will let you return it. You've got a 30-day return exchange policy. That's not going to be the case in any wigs, especially with a wig. That's a really cool thing here. And just $22.35, you get your wig home. Maybe you get it home, you open the box, you're like, oh, you know what? I think I wanted the other color. You can exchange it. We'll, do, we'll make it so easy for you. 
try it on. It comes with a cap. The cap that I had on, it comes with it. And even if you're like, okay, you know what? With the bangs, I want it like one little inch. I would bring it to your hairstylist. Absolutely. I wouldn't try to do it yourself, right, Martino? Uh, don't do it yourself. How about <laughs> right. that? Uh, I, yeah, just take yes. it to your hairdresser and let him or her trim up your bangs for you. But same wig, different color, styled a little different. Okay, so we've got a good question on Facebook. Gail wants to know, well, suppose it's windy. She's yep. afraid it's gonna blow off your head like a hat. Well, Gail, if you go on my YouTube <laughs> what, what channel, I posted a video called Footprints in the Sand recently, and I had gifted a wig to a mom who had breast cancer who was just pronounced cancer-free, so congratulations, Yay, that's Michelle. that's awesome. Um, and I took her and her family to an amusement park down at the Jersey Shore to create this video that you'll see on my YouTube. And I said, try wearing the wig, let's just see what happens. So she's on the Superman ride, and her kids <laughs> next to her and they're going and they're going and the wig stayed on there before God do I go because I didn't know what was going to happen. So I'm not saying it'll stay on with you on a music ride but it did in the video that you could watch. And That's see. really interesting. Yeah. Uh, you know if you really I mean does anybody do bobby I don't have any bobby pins I just put it on. Yeah, does no. anybody it's the, listen it's proprietary you have to remember <laughs> Hair You Wear and Gabor have been in the business of making wigs for 50 years. They've right. mastered it. These caps are proprietary and and trademarked. So um, it's just the way they're made. When people say, how does it stay on? I say, it's just the way they're made. It's, it is just the way they're made. Because I was going to say, um, I'm not a gymnast, but I probably could do some gymnastics in this thing and it would fall yeah, off. Wind's not it gonna not, blow it, yeah, wind's off. not going to blow It's not going to go anywhere. Um, this is the longest style. This is the style that is probably the last presentation. Uh, it is the most versatile. If you want to have like a wig that you can do, you know, little hair clips, you can put it up. Yeah, look at that. You can style it. You can't it. tell that's a wig. Yeah. And this is polished. <laughs> yes, and you can't tell it's a wig. It just looks like her hair yeah. had a really nice blow dry. Now, yeah, pretty. again, so pretty. I want you to know, long hair, you absolutely can put under these wigs without creating anything that looks bulky. So if you take a look at her hair, her before is really long. And we have it all wrapped up underneath and twisted. Well, not the one we're looking at. We're, we're gonna go to another one. We're looking oh, at sorry, this I'm one. I'm not even looking at No, 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 I'm that's okay. Um, so she has really long hair. I have long hair down to here. So we, I know that was a question on Facebook. People always wonder about yeah. that. If you have long hair, can you put it up in a wig? Will it look, will it look like a big bump? It will not. That, it will um, not. Is there a tutorial how to put your hair up if you have long hair for a wig? On YouTube, yes, yeah. there is. It's, um, I was gonna say, we usually do yours live. It's really simple, you're just, I'll pretend it with your wig. Turn around for me, I'll show them. You just take your own hair in two sections like this, and you take one on top of the other and pin the ends up, that's it. Yeah. See, people usually do like ponytails and that's why they're afraid it's, it's gonna be bulky. You just yeah. have to twist your own hair underneath. It is, and you know what? I'm getting used to me with dark hair. I got used to the gray hair. Yeah, I quickly get used to the new me. I am also somebody in real life that likes to change up my hair color and change up my hairstyle. I don't like to have the same thing, but you know what? That gets expensive. You can damage your hair, and I have damaged my hair. <laughs> yeah. I have, I've broken my hair, I've done all sorts of things. But That's you see, nice. she's got long hair, and you can see, and then it, you, you know, just up in the wig is like super easy, super fun. You know, freak out with your husband. Tell him you cut your hair off, uh. <laughs> right? <laughs> I cut off my hair, uh, or it's just a wig. Now, this is, also polished. This is also polished. Yeah, and it's so interesting. It looks different on everybody. Because you can style it different. Yeah. You know, another question I got, can you change the part? Absolutely, you can change the part. Remember, you can use heat up to 350 degrees. Part it the way you want to wear your own hair. If you want shorter bangs, have your hairdresser cut it. Make this yours. Take a look at her before shot. She hates her own hair. So she, <laughs> she gets so mad at me when I take the wig off because it really just looks like she got a really good blow dry and a lot of work was put in it to yeah. make that fine hair come to life and have volume, I but that's not say, what happened. It does. It looks like she just had her hair done. It looks like it's her, her hair, but she had it done. That's exactly yeah. what the... Love yeah, you love it? Yeah, <laughs> she loves it. Yeah, I mean, it, it's... If you go out to a restaurant, go out to the theater, somebody's sitting right next to you, nobody's going to know you have a wig on. No. The technology with wigs has just, like, gone through the roof. This is not like a wig like it is in the 50s, like Ingeborg was saying. It's not heavy. It's not hot. It's not shiny it, plastic. It's not shiny. 
shiny, and, and there's all these multi multiple colors and the texture. Look at that. I mean, this is high definition, close up shots of each color. You can see even a little slightly darker at the root, like Every, real hair. You're going to see so much element. dimension within these colors. Like I said earlier, there's seven to 11 different shades. So this is the light blonde that I'm holding. So it has a lot of really blonde highlights. When we go down to the medium blonde, still blonde, half the amount of blonde highlights. So still seven to 11 shades. The dark blonde is a much more softer, cooler blonde, almost okay. like a light brown. The medium red is gorgeous. You've got cinnamon, you've got copper, you've got caramel in it. It's really a beautiful color. And take a look, it looks like human hair. There's nothing that says this is a wig at all. The light brown, it's just a neutral, nice, soft brown. None of these colors will fade. They cannot fade when they're washed. They cannot fade in the sun. Your red's always right. gonna stay vibrant. And then when we go into the medium brown, this is a little bit richer. You're gonna notice there's more red tones, more gold tones. Your dark brown will work for dark brown, brown, or blonde. And then the light gray. The light gray is so light, this will work for that woman who emailed me and said, what about white? Can I get it in white? Right. You're gonna love this color. It's as close to white as you're gonna get. All right, I wanna do some updates with colors and then I'm gonna change my wig again. <laughs> okay. Um, in the visionary that I'm wearing, Okay, we've sold over 7,000. We started with 7,000 and we have 2,000 left. Less than 2,000 left now. What colors are sold out in the long? Dark blonde, this one is gone. In this medium blonde is 20 left. So if you want medium blonde, there's only 20 left in the longest. If, if you want the gray in the visionary, which is the longest, there's only 60, 60 of you can get, it looks like I'm, my hand is on someone's head. That's how real this looks. Um, there's 60 uh, um, right. orders left in the visionary. So visionary is what I'm wearing. It's the longest one. So I'm gonna change from visionary to polish and I'm gonna change to red. So when you're taking it off, I kind of lift it up here. Let me, and then put my hand on the cap because I've taken it on and off. So you see, it's got like, just like a little cap. It looks like a stocking. Like, like I'm gonna rob a bank, <laughs> right? I pull this over my face. <laughs> but you see, this is the back of my hair. I just pulled it up with a little cap over it, right? Doesn't it look like you're gonna rob a bank. We got the little, <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I think of bank robbers as like the 1920 movies. I don't know anything. Um, is this like the shorter one? You know what, let me, let me grab the other one. I grabbed the wrong one. I want you guys to see, I think this is, is this the shorter one? No, this is the shorter one, okay. Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, so I'm gonna put it on live. So there's little tags in the back, so you know the tags go in the back, just like, you know, when you're wearing a top, and then this, th then the opposite goes in the front. So you kinda hold the front in the back, kinda like a shower cap, stretch it over, like put it here, and then just pull it down. And that's it, that's it. And then you just do this. See, so, mm, this way, backwards on TV. Backwards on TV, okay. <laughs> I know, right? The, these are the little tabs, you can feel them. So I'm gonna make sure they're even, Good girl. right? That's exactly the way you do it. And then I like it kind of crazy up like this in the back, so I'm gonna go like that. And then there you go, I think that's it. I mean, what was that, two seconds? Uh, this way, this way, this way. Okay, there you go. There you go, so see, look. How easy is that? And then this is me with red. So I've done gray hair, I've done dark hair, and then this is the medium red in the polish, which is the middle one. It, it takes about two seconds. Do you like it, Becca? What do you think? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, it's, it's funny, to, it's fun to see people that see you all the time and see the different colors. So I'm wearing the polish in the medium red. So I've had red hair, I've had blonde hair, someday I'm gonna have gray hair. But it, to get that gray silver, it's very expensive to get it and keep it. This is a beautiful, beautiful silvery platinum color. I think that's one of my favorites. I'll tell you also with red, Martino, I had yes. red hair. Red hair is very difficult to keep the red in your hair. One of the reasons why I didn't stay being red is the red, I would get it done and then it would just wash it's out. so much maintenance. And that's the thing with, with these right? wigs because there's no cuticle. The reds don't fade. The blondes won't turn brassy. The gray won't get that yellow hint to it. Your right. browns won't get brassy. Now, I just received an email from a viewer at home saying, can you please put the visionary wig on someone and incorporate her own bangs in it? Now, I don't have any tools with me. All their hair <laughs> has been slicked back in ponytails all day long. So, but I still had my friend Stephen pull it out. I'm gonna bring her over right now and just show you. Steve, send her on over. We'll finish it right here. Okay, so 
just a, you want her she's wearing the longest wig and you want her to have the bangs come out so yeah so <laughs> All last right. night last night when we were doing the wigs uh one of the hosts had her own bangs incorporated in oh, into, was, that, was that suzanne yes okay. so as you can see that is her own hair right there okay so if i knew that you were going to ask me that, I would have round brushed her bangs to go in uh, the same, you know, pattern as the uh, as the wig. And yes, you absolutely can incorporate my hairspray. You can oh, incorporate your own bangs. You can incorporate your own hairline. And absolutely, you can do that. Absolutely. Oh, interesting. Yeah. And mind you, this was hair that was up and up ponytail for the last who, who knows yeah, how many yeah. hours right but had right. i blow dried it that way absolutely i would pull some of these side pieces here and yeah you absolutely can incorporate them absolutely. but then she still pulls it down on the side yeah, of the tab yes. and on the side yeah you, she still pulls them down but you can yeah. totally look at that that's her bang that's the wig. You absolutely can integrate the two. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that is a that is a great question. By the way, we're here live. I <laughs> wanted to answer it for yeah, you. Yeah, let me give you our toll-free testimonial line again. It's 1-866-376-8255. Oh, or stay on the line after you purchase. This is one day, one day only. At the end of the day, this price goes away. If you've always wondered, hmm, what would it be like to wear a wig? Today's the day to do it. Or maybe you've worn wigs your whole life, and you're like, I can't believe this wig is $89. And those of you who wear wigs all the time know that $89 is a crazy low price for a high quality wig. One with a lot of dimension, beautiful colors, and really natural that has all these high end everything. And then Gabor Wigs makes some of the best wigs in the world for decades. So Gabor, you think of Zsa Zsa Gabor, Eva Gabor, you know, the Gabor sisters. So those of you who are, you know, film buffs know that the gorgeous, I mean, some of the biggest movie stars, you know, classic big, you know, beauties in the world, they wear wigs. So everybody wanted to have that amazing hair. My hair, I don't have a tenth of this hair. This is like <laughs> 10 times more hair than I have. This is like somebody else's hair, right? Yeah. I, I have very thin, fine hair. I could never do, I could never pull this off it with my own real hair. It looks great on you. <laughs> Again, I want to talk about that, how natural these wigs look and that you're not seeing that fake, shiny, plasticky looking hair that you see on a, in a lot of wigs. This looks great on her. She can tuck it behind her ear if she wants to tuck it behind her ear. She can put it up in a little updo if she wants to put it in updo. She can cut the bang if she wants a real bang and not a side sweep bang. There's nothing you can't do with it. All right, so it is going to be a new year, 2020, in about a, oh, less than a week. So we're doing something here at HSN where we're talking about the new year. You know, maybe you're going to spend a little more time on yourself, thinking about yourself. A Gabor wig is a great way to do that. We actually asked Martino, hey, what do you do when you're not in the salon and you're not doing, you know, <laughs> charity work? What does is, what is a guy like this do for fun? Take a look. <laughs> I love to fish. I would not have guessed that. My whole life, I wanted to catch a sailfish. And about three weeks ago in Fort Lauderdale, I caught my first sailfish. It took me an hour to reel him in and uh yeah i was screaming like a little kid at christmas i love it yeah i love it i love the fish you know i think that it's funny like what i did for a living before i came here is um i'm a stand-up comedian and i still do it all the time and it's like whenever i'm not here it is what i do for fun so here's me uh on a day off at a comedy club uh i can you can check my website or on facebook i'll post when i do live shows maybe some of you will come out and see me but it, it is it is what i do for fun <laughs> isn't awesome. it it's my fun. I say, I always say to my husband, it gets everything out of my brain. Okay. <laughs> you know, when you do, it gets everything. You do that all the time in your life. <laughs> Fishing is just my, oh my gosh. It's just so beautiful out on the water. And then you wait for the dolphins to come by. My husband and... fish, he loves it. I don't know. It's amazing. I think it's a dude thing, maybe. I don't know. Some women love to fish, I guess. Ingerborg, yeah. do you fish? I, I have fished in um, Palm Beach. Oh, really? Did I you caught, like it? I caught a fish my first time. <laughs> oh, did you? But I haven't been fishing since then. I go boating, though. I love boating. Yeah, the And I wear my wig. Well, oh, my. you do? <laughs> does your wig come off when you're boating? It doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's, that's the most great. important thing. So now you have a middle part. So yeah. again, to the question, can you change the part? She's got a middle part now, so... Oh, gosh. All right, we just hit over 10,000 of our Today's Specials sold today. 
almost 11,000. Oh boy. So they're crazy popular. I know we're kind of coming into the evening, into prime time. Um, we have lost some colors. The longer style that you're looking at on Ingerboard right now, that is very popular. We started out with 7,000. We have under 2,000 now, and we have sold out of some colors. The Okay, so the dark blonde and the medium blonde are both sold out in the in the visionary, which is the style you're looking at. And you can make this, wow, that's that looks so cute. And that yeah. looks different than yes. the other, it looks so different mm -hmm. than the other style. Yes, you can scrunch this wig, use your favorite hairspray. I'm using my flexible hairspray here at HSN, but you can just spray it, scrunch it, spray it, scrunch it. It looks even, it looks a little shorter, actually. Yes, you're bringing it almost like a faux bob, you know, like. Oh, you look at that. Like, yes. Yeah, that's so cute. <laughs> so cute. I like the middle part. You know, it looks so natural. It does. It looks so much like a real hair. Like, it's yes. amazing to... I love when you have the warm red colors. You like with your, that? With your, it's like in the pink in your cheeks. It brings it out. I, I think those look so pretty on you. I wanted to dye my hair, and I thought, you know what? Should I really do that? And I thought, no way. I'm just going to wear the Gabor wigs. It makes sense to me. They're lightweight. When I she just has, love them. She has hair that's very fine and fragile. Yeah. And I had a woman today email me, and she said that her hair is fragile. It's brittle. Is it going to damage her hair if she puts the wig over top of it. And the answer to your question is, it's the absolute opposite. It's gonna mm -hmm. help protect your hair because mm -hmm. it's gonna protect it from the sun and the elements and you're gonna be putting less heat on it because you're not gonna be blow drying it anymore. So actually wearing the wig gives your own hair a break. Yes. And, and in the visionary, in the gray, there's 30 orders left. Oh wow. 30, they started out with 7,000 in that style. I'll show you what it looks like orders. real quick. Yeah, we probably visionary. should get, that's why I said we should probably get that, the gray out here so you guys at home get to see it because this is like last call, last look, 30 orders. See, this looks completely different too. So this is the same one except it's pinned back to get yes. it out of her face. She's got a couple bobby pins in it. Cute. Um, yeah. So cute. This one is really versatile. It, it is. It has a lot of versatility. I can see why everybody's like, you know, I think that there's an argument to get more than one. You know, different, sty different I've styles. I've been telling everybody all day right? you should get more than one in different colors. Oh, Once yeah. Once you step outside your comfort zone right. and get used to it, you'll have them hanging up in your closet on hangers. You'll have like six or oh, seven yeah. of them for sure. I mean, you have more than one color of like t-shirt. Why not yes, more than and one shoes. color wig? Sometimes you shoes wear white gold, sometimes you wear yellow gold. Yes. Why not? get different wigs for different outfits, different occasions. Think about it, you go on a cruise. Everybody's hair looks horrible on a cruise because it's humid, <laughs> it's windy. You are correct, but you sir. You can just put wigs on. I mean, you put the beautiful red on for the captain's dinner, put the blonde for breakfast and brunch. I mean, have fun. Yeah, I agree. I agree. You know, as we, uh, you know, when Gabor comes here and brings all these amazing wigs, um, I, I'd love for them to do like a real long wig. We should have, you know, like super long. That would be crazy too. Look at this. So that she looks like it, a chignon. Yeah, and she did it herself. That's amazing. She did it herself. Oh my goodness. That looks, that's <laughs> crazy. That looks like a beautiful, you, elegant updo. All of these women, including yourself, have something in common. When your wig was applied to your head, yes. you changed your attitude. <laughs> yes. All you got a little sassy, yeah, a little you got sassy, a little spring a little in sassy, your step, yes. you know. That's what happens to a woman when she gets her hair done. That, that I is know. True. My grandmom, yes. she lived to 98 years old, and she always said, when my hair looks good, I feel, feel good. good. I'm going to go ask for a raise. I'll be right back. <laughs> I feel like I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> oh. We just went over 11,000 sold, by the way. Over 11,000. 11,000 of you. Um, let's do Ingrid's, uh, Ing the before and after. I can't even, like, look at that before and after. There, like, it's who amazing. is that? And if you're who just tuning in, she did this herself. She put the wig on herself. She put it in her little updo all by herself. I didn't do anything but stand here. That's it. She okay. did it by herself. So I do want to give you another way to save today is if you want to save $20 on your Today Special and not get it for $89, get it for $69 and $99, you That's can apply for an update. HSN card. We're doing $20 off a single item purchase at time of approval. Go to hsn.com, put an HSN card in the search, or call the um, 800 number, 695-1418. So I'm gonna take the red one off, and I'm gonna put on a different color. This one is light blonde. Light blonde in the polish. All right, we're doing me close up. Okay, so I'm gonna have my hand on the little cap, which I think is going further and further back, because this is like the fourth time I've taken it off. Um, I shake it, shake it a little bit more. Just shake it, just give it a little shake before you put it on your head. The tags go in the back, the front, opposite of the tags. Shake it and then place it here and then just put it on. And boy, this feels so secure, so secure. I just have like 
my earpiece. <laughs> you guys don't wear earpieces, but I'll fix that later. So I'll do this. I'll go over here and then like this. Yeah. Look at that. That's two seconds. Let me just go up in the back. I like it where it's kind of fun and sassy in so the back. So a little tip for you at home, just take your blow dryer when you're putting the wig on and go like this, Helen, take a look. Just use the air from the blow dryer like this. It'll open everything oh, up in really? two seconds. Yeah, okay. you can spray a little hairspray while you're blowing. It'll open it all up. Here's another updo uh, with the wig. So you can see it looks so natural. It's beautiful. She's got some of her own hair incorporated in it right there. And you would never know that's a wig. No way. Oh, gosh. Isn't that great? Oh. <laughs> I think I got this back in there. It's really my earpiece, not the wig. <laughs> the earpiece, I'm giving up on it. Um, oh my goodness. Yeah, and, and look at that, that's two seconds. I think that's so cute. So that's the, the, the style that is the longest. That is called visionary. James, could you help me, help me, help me, help me. <laughs> Martino, you yeah. talk. Sorry, no problem. <laughs> Just playing with the bangs a little bit. Everybody has a different part because, you know, look, not everybody's face's shape is the same, so you can change these to fit your style, what you're used to. Um, this is the same wig that's in an updo to my left, so you can get it home, you can put it in an updo, you can put your clips in it, you can put headbands in it, you can put your sunglasses on your head and still not be able to tell it's a wig. So that looks great. Yeah, that looks good, Helen. You like that? I do like What's it. What's your favorite? I've done, this is like look number four. I think I would like, my favorite would be that in gray on you. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just, you love that gray. Yeah, but I want to see the longer one on like the one you're wearing now. Yeah, uh, and, and this is called polish. So this is the medium one. And this one, can, you can wear this so many different ways. You can change how you wear the front, you can change the bangs, mm -hmm. you can change the back. I mean, these, it's really, and it's with your fingers. With your fingers. And listen, when you, if you're on the fence, you're not sure which one you wanna get, or you have a question and you can't get into the call center or call in here now to talk to us, you can shoot me an email, martino at martinocartier.com. I've been checking my phone all day long trying to address all your comments and all your questions. Right. So um, and feel we're free, live on my Facebook. phone's your phone. Yeah, and we're live on Facebook oh, right so now. Oh, you on Facebook so and my, ask the my question. my producer is also monitoring the Facebook page. So the, some of the questions that we had earlier in the show, we have about 15 minutes left in the show, is if you have long hair, can you put it up? I have long hair, you, there's no bump. Does it stay on? Yes, it does, even on a roller coaster. Even on a roller coaster, <laughs> if boating. you go on my YouTube, look at the footprints <laughs> in the sand video. Right, and uh, you know, get more than one. Today's the day because the price is never gonna be better. Yeah. You can you can get wigs at a lot of different places, but a high-end Gabor wig for $89, this is, I mean, we have a regular HSM price at $109, but you go to a wig store, I mean, oh, that is... I, trust me, I know. You know, because you, you know, your, your charity, you guys have people donating wigs, and they can... Wigs can be $5,000. Easy. Yeah. Easy. You know, Easy. A lot of the wigs that we donate to the kids are $5,000, because you need a long, really long wig for a kid, and girls want... The little girls want human hair, because they want to be able to color it, and they want to be able to this and that. But I, real quick, since more people keep asking, can you put long hair under yes. it? Yes. I just would like to show you real fast how to do that. You're, all you're going to do is take the head the hair into two sections. Go underneath each other, twist, and just pin that up. And, and you then, go underneath to make it flat, right? Yep, yep. And then this one, we're gonna go this way. Just like that. Okay. Without a mirror. And by the way, the cap that he's gonna put on next, next is included. That's right. And you're just using regular bobby pins. Regular, but you get a couple with the wig. And um, that's it. So you want it to be spread out around the head. That way it's flat. So now, just because I don't have a mirror, I'm gonna ask you to just hold that for me. Thank you. And I'm gonna tuck all the hair under. Slide that back. And that's really it. And then, which wig did you have on? You wanna put it back on? Sure. Yeah, and it, you know, tags go in the back. She gives it a little shake. You know, you hold it in the front, hold it in the back, and just boom. There's these two little tabs on the side that you can, you know, even up with yourself. And then you, f you can 
Style it with your fingers. Yeah, so the tabs are right here. So when you put your fingers on the tabs, see how her, my fingers are straight? That's how I know the wig's on even. Yeah. Right? So these are even. You want to make sure the back's pulled down and then just open it up. You can use your blow dryer just to blow some air, but look how great that looks. You know, and, I like you with dark hair. It shows your blue eyes. Like Elizabeth Taylor, that kind of like dark hair, light eyes look. And look it at looks her, amazing. Look at her profile. There's nothing yeah. sticking up. She's right. just enough volume. There's a permanent back combing in here that'll always give you that volume in the crown without splitting. That's like um, money right there. Yeah, yeah it's so really I love awesome. that. What that's amazing. Simple and easy. And this is again visionary. So there's three different styles. I'll run over. I know we just have a couple minutes left. We have about 10 minutes left in the show. There's three different styles. Visionary is the longest one, the one you're looking at right now. By the way, in the gray, we're so limited. Oh, it just sold out. Okay, so three colors sold out in Visionary. This is Laughter. This is the shortest one. This is the one um, that is kind of that fun pixie kind of cut. We have all colors. Then we have Polish. That is the one I'm wearing. Actually, I'm wearing this color. I'm wearing the light blonde. Dark blonde just sold out. But we have all the other colors. Look how fun this is in the back. You just go like this. This is how you style it. You just go like this with your fingers. It's so fun. So this is called polish. Then the last one is visionary. We have th three colors gone now. Gray, medium blonde, and dark blonde. So those colors are gone, but we do have, you know, the red, the light blonde, the and, uh, you know, the, the medium brown, the dark brown. So if you, this is the most versatile, and this is styled, look at, look at all the different, all the different colors. It's not just one color hair. That's why it looks so crazy natural. Look at that. You know what? Here are all the colors on the side. Someone is asking, if you wear glasses, do, does it get in the way? And I will tell you, I thought the same thing. I wear reading glasses and I was getting ready for the show. I put my glasses on. You do Which feel you like, it you know day. what, it depends. If you're wearing the shorter one, I do it like, you do it like right over the wig, just like it's like your regular hair. It does, maybe you will take your glasses just out just a, like a centimeter of an inch because with a wig, you probably have more hair than you usually have, right? Yes. Come, come with me. Put the glasses under the wig. That's or, all. I oh, tell them to put them under the wig. Oh, oh under the wig? Okay. Mm -hmm. I was yeah. going to say, because you put it over the wig, you have to pull them out just like a teeny bit because you probably have more hair than you're used yeah, to having. Yeah, and then it's going to hold your hair in place. So just put them underneath your oh, wig underneath and, wig, the wig. and yeah, you'll be good to go. But yeah, I then your glasses you. will stay on too. Yeah. <laughs> right? I want to show you the red because um, oh, yeah. I know we have the red left. We do. And the red is a we beautiful do. color. Medium red. Medium red Available. is gorgeous. There's lots of caramel, <laughs> cinnamon, highlights, low left. light, mid light. There's only 100 left. In this style, in the visionary, the Look longest style color. in the this medium red. This color is so I love it on. sexy. You have I to have it. this wig. Mm. If you don't have this wig, you have to get this wig. I'm going to wear this wig on air. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna again see, and again. I'm going to be it's doing so a DG2 beautiful. show and you're going to come out wearing this wig. <laughs> I know that you'll. this is you. Yeah, that's a gorgeous color. And it's the only love red it. that we have. Yeah. The only red that we have this trip, so. I love um, that it's all different colors. It looks like there's strawberry blonde highlights. There are. And then darker red underneath. There it's are. It's like so beautiful. Absolutely, seven to 11 different shades to create this color within the wig. Mm -hmm. And because it's not done by a, a person with a foil comb, yeah. it's so much more even, and the colors are distributed through the hair perfectly as if it was your natural color. You know, I'm looking at it, and if I went to my hairstylist and, and brought this wig and I said, do this, I don't think it would be even possible. It would be an awful lot of work, I'll tell you that. <laughs> it would be an awful lot of work, an awful lot of money. Yeah. And in six weeks, you'd have to do it all over again. Yeah, it would be a lot. And that's the thing. Keep in mind, reds fade. The yes. People that color their hair red, you know that it fades. This red can't fade. These <laughs> wigs can't fade. None of them. Your gray's not going to turn yellow. Your red's not going to wash out. Your blondes aren't going to get brassy. The color is the color is the color. And because there's mm -hmm. no cuticle, the hair can't frizz up. And it will always remain the way it's styled until until you change it using heat with 350 degrees, which no one's gonna do, so you're gonna wind up having this beautiful volume and style for a long, long time. <laughs> so I'm gonna do last call across the board with the visionary. The medium red, the light brown, all of them, there's 40 left in the light brown. Jeez. I mean, they're all gonna go. So if you want the visionary, which is the longest style, this is probably the last presentation where you're even gonna see them. So gray is sold out, medium, dark blonde and medium blonde are gone. We have the medium red. I know we have had 100 left, Aaron, in the medium red? 
Less than 100 now. It's one of my Way favorite. Less than this now. is one of we my favorite now, colors. If I had to pick one of my favorite colors mm -hmm. out of all of them, this is probably one of my favorite colors. And I will nice. say agreed because it's almost impossible to not only get it but keep that keep color. It. Right. It Keeping can't that fade. color. It cannot fade. Right. Keep that in mind. Yeah. You can't, can't wash it fade. out. It's not going to come out in the sink. No, you could wash it every day the wig and it would <laughs> right. never fade. It's impossible. Yeah. And how much do you pay to get your hair cut? and colored. The color, you know, if the least expensive in the country is maybe $60 for just like a single process. This is not one color like a helmet. Everyone has highlights and low lights and root smudging and what? Yeah, it has you, everything, right? If you, if you just look down, if I you mean, get a close-up shot right there, you're going to see just in the front here, how it's filled. There you go. Let me turn you <laughs> that way. That's what I wanted to show right here. Is that gorgeous or what? When I yeah. pull it tight, you can really right, see exactly. the color. Exactly. Those are all, I mean, if you, if you went okay. to your hairstylist, this way is $89. How much would you pay just to get a haircut and even highlights in a partial highlight in the front? This is, so, you're going to save so much money. Maybe you want to go to your, get your hair color twice a year instead of every six weeks. Get a wig. A wig is a game changer. Um, I don't think that I've been on television in the last 30 years without some hair enhancement. Let's, <laughs> let's just put it that way, right? Yeah, we some all hair, have hair enhancements. enhancements. <laughs> We all do. Is there like true serum to that? <laughs> but yeah, we've all had, right? I mean, it's no one's hair looks like, and especially, you know, I'm 57. You see a 57 year old with thick, gorgeous hair, it's probably a wig. Don't you think? Yeah, pretty much. I, I mean, I you that, see right? everybody and you see everything in your salon. This is the same color, but in the shorter wig. Oh, look at that. That's, the, that's the, what I'm wearing is yes. the polish, polish. polish. But and notice how it's styled different. So like all three of you have the same one and you both, all three of you are wearing it a little yeah. different. And that's what's fun about this. This is not a that's cookie pretty cutter pretty wig. Oh when you gosh. get this home, you're gonna be able to comb it, you're gonna be able to brush it and style it the way you wanna wear it. Look at, you know, what I really notice is how her eyes, eyes look, pop. how her eyes pop. I knew you were gonna say that. You know what, I'm like, I'm like, you know, I never would have thought that until I see these different colors on her. Yeah. I just, I just realized how be amazingly beautiful, violet, her eyes. The blonde do doesn't do that to her eyes as much as these colors Did do. Did you see how easy it was to change the part? Yeah. So there you, it's, go. you know, that's been in the number one question I've been asked all day on email is, can you change the part? Beautiful. Ooh. By the way, the red that we just had on in the longer style, the visionary, there's only 40 left now. Yeah. See, seeing it on Ingerborg, everybody's like, gotta have uh -huh. it, gotta have it. And you're seeing it now, I mean, this is, I, this, I really like this wig is like kind of the best of both worlds. It's short, but it has a lot of volume. Yeah, and you and can that's really, really dress you want, this right? up. You yeah. can really dress this wig up for sure. Okay, so we're getting a question, if I order it and get a color, can I return it for another color? And I know the answer is yes. Sure. You could return everything <laughs> here. It's not all sales final. This isn't like a wig store where you walk out, when you pass the threshold of the door, that wig is yours permanently. Absolutely. And, and that's the case with wig stores, right? 100%, you're so, not allowed to return them. Yeah, you can. You can return them and you can exchange them. Um, but, you know, we are obviously getting low in stock. If you want to exchange it for a color that's sold out that we don't have anymore. Then we can't help th you. Then we can't. But, you know, so. But I would talk. talk cause that's what the number on your screen is for. Call and ask your representative. You know, say what style you want, what color, and we'll tell you what you have. Maybe your you're heart is set on medium red, but it doesn't really matter to you if you get, like, a little longer, a little shorter. You know, you'll see you where you... You can always get a cut. Trust me. You can always get this cut. You can put this wig on, put it on. On, kind of comb it the way you think you're going to want it and then you're going to say oh I wish this was a little shorter or maybe I wish this part was moved a little bit go to your hairdresser and just have them cut it yeah I love it let's go over to the colors and do it sure. one more time I know we've got sure. about five minutes left in the show okay um, the visionary is kind of limited crazy across the board so let's go through all the colors all the colors yeah. so we're going to start with our light blonde which has a lot that's of, what I'm wearing yes a lot of platinum highlights in it this is your high lift beautiful princess blonde then we go to medium blonde still highlighted but nowhere near the amount of platinum it's just more of a softer that's why we call it medium blonde okay the dark blonde is more of your cool blonde, your ashy brown. Okay. For those people that like that soft, really soft, natural ash look. The medium red, we just went over, you know, you've got copper, you've got caramel, you've got strawberry blonde, and then you've got that deep, deep, deep red that pops. Uh, then we're gonna take you to the light brown. The light brown is, again, another neutral color, but it still has seven to 11 different shades, and you can see all of them in my hand as I'm holding it. Then when we go to the medium brown, this is a little bit richer. You're gonna notice there's a red undertone a gold undertone. When we go to the dark brown, 
This would work for anybody with dark brown hair, black hair, and then the light gray. The light gray will work mm. if your hair is white. I got that email today. Can I? Will it work for me if it's white? Yes. This is not a, a, a dull looking gray. This is a bright light gray, right. which is why it'll work for white. It'll work for someone that has a little bit of salt and pepper. It's going to work for a lot of different. So in the visionary, I've got four colors left. Oh boy. So I've got light blonde, medium. Do I have medium blonde, Erin? Gone. So I have light blonde, uh, dark, li okay, last call on light brown. I've got light, bl light blonde, light brown, sorry. <laughs> I give up. Last call, and I've got medium brown, and then I've got the dark one right here, which is called dark brown. So these are the four. I have one, two, three, and four. That's what I have left in the visionary. That's the longest style. In the polish, I have everyone except dark blonde. So you can get any of these colors in the one I'm wearing except the dark blonde. Um, and then the laughter, there is all the colors. Now we were expecting to have all the colors till the end of the day. We didn't realize that everything's going to be flying out the door and that we don't have enough. You know, we try to guess what the most popular it's style. Impossible. It's impossible look to at, guess. Look at this in look a completely different style. This is just a nice like business look. This mm. is like, you know. And this is dark brown. This is the dark brown. So if you brown. want the look of like black hair, like I think Bobby was wearing this yes, color as well. absolutely. This is, it, it looks black, but it's called dark Isn't brown. Isn't so sharp though? It is beautiful. So sharp. I, you know, I feel like I've seen you in that way. <laughs> I feel like I've said, this, so is, we this changed, is familiar, Inger. We changed this. We haven't done dark on her yet. And um, uh -huh. this is the first time, but her eyes are really popping as well. Look at your well. eyes in that. Mm -hmm. Wow. I've never had brown. You've never had brown hair? Oh, look at that. <laughs> I think this it's really sexy. I think it's really amazing because your eyes look like magic in the, when your hair is dark like that. Um, we're coming up to 12,000 sold in about a second. Look at that. Such a whole, whole different, whole different person. She whole does. different. It's so funny. You know how your hair color, how that, how that changes. So you go to your hairstylist. You're going to spend more than eighty nine dollars to get your hair color. Give it a try first with a wig. That's one way to look at a wig, right? Before you know, go about your life. See what your husband, friends, family, coworker get a get a survey. You know, and if you don't, if you love it, then say, hey, guess what? I don't have to wash and style my hair. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? This is what irritates me. My husband and I would go to the theater. I'll start getting ready an hour and a half. He'll be like, okay, I'm coming in. All right, I'm gone. What? <laughs> you know what? You guys know what I'm talking about, right? Well, You're like, what? Oh, yes. No, it's like I had to get a snack. It took me so long. I just stopped for, I just stopped for gas. I mean, it was ridiculous. I'm like, uh, you, it's just, with a wig, boom. Yeah, and here's the thing, right? So if... For those of you that don't know how to do your own hair, it's really hard. You throw it in a ponytail, you go to work, nobody says, oh my gosh, your ponytail looks beautiful today, right? So when you have a wig like this on your head and it's something that gives you, you know, that spring in your step, you're gonna get compliments on your hair and that always is a way to have a great day. Let's bring all the girls out so that you can see we got one minute left. You guys know where to go. I want you to see what Come they on. look like on all different types the of women. The beauties. Yes, it does. And the same wig, <laughs> two different colors. Same wig, two different colors. And it doesn't matter if your hair is fine, if your hair is long, if it's color treated. These women all have one thing in common. They feel beautiful. <laughs> look, dude, just went over 12,000 souls. That's so, amazing. So Congratulations awesome. on looking beautiful. Congratulations <laughs> to all of you that got the Gabor wig. I hope that 2020 is your best hair year yet. And don't forget, if you need any help with your wig or questions about today's presentation, you can shoot me an email right to my phone, martino at martinocardi.com. I'll be back at what time? I was going to ask you that. You think I know? <laughs> I literally, I think, Aaron, what time are they back? I think 9, nine. and 11, nine. something like okay, that. Okay, the models all know, 9 o'clock. Yeah. Okay, yeah, nine ask the girls. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. All right, well, stay tuned, you guys. I'm